when we talk about, you know, going out and having experiences, I mm -hmm. think this is one that we can definitely say will be an experience. But sure. then there is a queen of experiences, I... and her name is Gushe Adams. Oh, uh, man, I'm, I'm, I love her to bits, and she knows how much I love her, but I've hated her from the start <laughs> of this <laughs> year because she has just done the most amazing things, and she looks amazing. I promise me, okay, count how many outfits she wears throughout this journey, in okay? One. In one session, in okay, one. please. Um, okay, but to, to travel is to live. Yeah. I think that's the bottom line. We know it on our job. And KZN is the plug, and it's a hub for entertainment, for mm -hmm. adventure, and yes, very important to Kutle leisure as well. I think a bucket list destination with a little bit of something for everyone. 100%, and the beautiful Kutle was there to explore the fun-filled getaway that the Drakensberg has wow. to offer. And you know how much we all love the Drakensberg, right? But let's see it from Kutle's lens and see what she got up to. Still hate. I cannot contain my excitement. We are hitting the long road from Johannesburg all the way to KwaZulu Natal. I mean, the views, the adventure, and the music are all calling my name. Godwa, we are doing it in style in the new Isuzu. Hop in. Masambe. Zabamnand. To truly savour the essence of any region, one must embark on a culinary journey exploring different flavours and tastes. Right now, it's time for us to dive into the delights of the Drakensberg. Chef, <laughs> can you please tell us more about what is on the plate right now? Uh, we've got the Drakensberg river trout. It's fresh from the water. Everyone that comes here, they enjoy. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I am going to enjoy. How is this unique to the region of Drakensberg? Yeah, in the Drakensberg, the trout, it makes us special because we get it from our own river here. Yeah. With our exotic spices and our ideas, we make it very special. I can't wait to dig in in Gwastikapul. I'm sure you're going to enjoy, Sissi. Quad biking in nature is always a good idea, but listen to this. Quad biking, surrounded by the beautiful Drakensberg Mountains, is taking it to the next level. Hi, buddy. Quad biking is one of my favorite activities of all time. Truly, KZN has it all. You can never get tired of coming this side of the country. There's always new spaces, new corners to explore and experience, and there's always something to do that caters to everyone's needs. You know, Mr. Mkize, I think Itidima is one of my favorite places. I mean, look at the stunning views behind us. Thank you for, for having us. Can you please tell us more about Ezem Velo, KZN Wildlife? Ezem Velo, KZN Wildlife is a state-owned entity that is responsible for biodiversity conservation and also the management of ecotourism facilities in the province. So we've got quite a number of these uh, beautiful places that we want to attract visitors to come and enjoy nature with us. I am both excited and nervous and anticipating where we're going to be landing, Namshaja. But this right here is honestly the best way to experience the beauty of KZN. The hot air balloon was everything I expected and more. Initially, I was a bit nervous and excited because I just didn't know much about the hot air balloon. But once I started talking to Tay and she explaining to me, you know that it just goes with the wind. For me, that sounded so poetic. We land where we land. You cannot tell me this is not heaven. Okay, look at the sunrise right behind us. It's breathtaking. It feels like you are closer to creation. We are knocking on heaven's gates. <laughs> we had a soft landing. I think that one will forever be etched in my heart. We are driving up 6,335 feet above sea level. I can't wait to continue exploring this 4x4 trail as we are driving up Mike's Pass. You can already imagine the views and the entire experience being so fulfilling. Let's go. 
Zip. Today is truly an exciting day because we just mm. drove up Mike's Pass. The terrain is bumpy. There are twists and turns. What would you say makes Isuzu 4x4 the perfect vehicle for this kind of adventure? At Isuzu Motors SA, we really pride ourselves in the ingenuity and the reliability of our vehicles. As a brand, we innovate where it matters. Buckies that are built in South Africa for South Africans, for South African terrains. Jazz at the Berg is currently underway and we are about to sing and dance along to immaculate sounds of Zoe Modicha, Loyiso and Mandisi Gyanjis. Let's get the party started already. <laughs> A man who does not need much introduction, Loiso here at Jazz at the Berg. How are you feeling? How excited are you? It's my first time at Jockensburg, so I'm just so glad to be experiencing the mountains and the beautiful weather. And I think also the drive coming here, seeing the mountains grounded me. And now I'm so excited to come on stage and just perform my heart out. off the stage, Zoe Modicha. The performance was absolutely electrifying. How are you feeling? I am feeling electrified. What makes performing in KZN special to me is that it is the province of my birth, the province that informed all I am as a person, the province that informed a lot of messages in my music, the things that I sing of, that I speak of. What a magical couple of days for this Easter break. Thank you, KZN, for yet another memorable time. Okay, so I counted five wardrobe changes there. Oh, my friend, you are so beautiful. Thank you for taking us on that incredible adventure. I don't think KZN bears comparison as a tourist destination. Absolutely exquisite. Um, and you got your plug-in. Go out there and explore your world.